BD5 Pilot back with you after a very long time. Look at what I've got. I've got the headers back with the bungs for the EGT sensors. And I've got the adapter machined thanks to the master engineer, Bill Esther, out at Independence Air Park, fabricating this part for me. I've got to get the rest of the bolts for that, but see how they're recessed to make that flush. And then the donut fits on and bolts on to allow for a little bit of uh, offset of the drive shaft. Now, I'll, I'll still have to have the uh, jack shaft made to attach it to the engine, but now I'm ready to mount the engine and attach it to the other rubber donut on that side when I get the jack shaft made. And here's the other parts I had made a set of spacers, aluminum spacers. Each one is a 16th inch longer so that it can uh, take into account the little offset the engine has to take to uh, align perfectly with that uh, drive shaft. And then the Delrin shoulder washers and washers so that I don't have metal to metal contact with the way the motor mounts. So the bolts will go through, but the Delrin will keep that isolated from the aluminum so that the engine doesn't uh, vibrate problems into the uh, motor mount but uh, there's my work for the weekend and uh, I'll be back uh, hopefully posting something this so week. Would you say that's cause to be excited about the BD5 project? I do. I'll see you all soon.